Hey guys, I'm Steve Little Forest Sun and I'm here. And today I'm just going to teach you how to do this really simple trick to um, your French braid that a lot of girls do. And this is very easy for everyone to do because if you're like me and are not a braider and get your braiding skills from your mom, because my mom stinks at braiding. Sorry, this like flex is annoying me. You can always spray this down though. And um, you don't know how. This is a perfect... Um, idea and I wear this on nights out or to school when I'm just feeling um extra girly that day so to get a full look it just looks like this and so now I'm going to show you guys um how to get I'm going to show I'm going to get uh I'm going to get started and show you guys how I do this look First off, what I'm going to be doing is taking a little strand from wherever I parted my hair. You're going to want to part more hair to the side that you're doing than you were if it was split in the middle so that's a braid going across. Now, I'm going to, um, what's it called? I'm going to do my hair actually a little bit different and take at least this much more and put it to the other side. I've parted my hair kind of weird, um, but in the end it will look very, very nice. So I actually took just a little bit more and just put it over to this side. And now I'm going to keep all this like this. And I'm going to begin my process. What you're going to do is take a small little section right here. And none of this has to be perfect. Just take one of the sections, mine's small as can be, and twist it. Either way works, but I like to twist it this way. So... I don't push forward, I push back and twist back. Now I'm just going to take a small piece of hair and add it and just twist. Take another hair, add it and twist. And as you keep adding, your braid is going to get tighter as as you start to um, twist more. So if you want it really tight like this, mine kind of puffs up when I do that, you can do that. I actually have, so I have worn it like this one time, puffed up. It's actually been really, really pretty, but I don't like twisting mine that much. Then, once I do that, I'm just going to keep adding and adding on. And if you have highlights, this will be perfect because it really adds a flare to your, um, to your highlights, adding in and all highlights going different ways, and it looks really cool. doing your braid you're just going to fasten it tightly with a bobby pin. I like to do mine with a colored pin that matches my hair so that I can um <laughs> sorry so that I can match my hair and it looks really natural like there's nothing even holding it. Why is this not? Hmm. Sorry, this bobby clip is really new. It's not working. Like I want to. Okay, so here we are. And I have my braid. And now anyone who's at home, if you would like to try it, it's really easy. It's really simple. You don't have to braid. And it's really nice. I messed up in a lot of areas. 